should do, which is what your wife tells you to do. Yeah. And uh, so I found myself cleaning and staining our deck back home. And then a thought came to my mind, well, this is a very tedious, repetitive task. Why not let the robot do it for me? I immediately remind myself, Gal, this is not going to happen. You promised your wife no more startups. And since I don't keep my word, I started looking into, it, into the idea, and here we are, eight months later, with us with you. Uh, first, let's understand what's the problem with DEX. So, uh, wouldn't DEX require ongoing maintenance in order to keep their vivid looks and longevity? Uh, today, this is done manually, uh, using power tools, but this is a very labor-intensive and time-consuming process, which makes it very expensive. From over 200 people I interviewed, only two were satisfied with their deck maintenance. Most of the people complain that they are almost always behind on their deck maintenance. To make things even worse, the current solution doesn't really solve the problem. So you invested the resources and treated your deck, and it looks great when you finish. But then, three months later, it doesn't look so good. And after 12 months, it must be treated again. So actually, most of the time, decks look unkept. Uh, such a labor-intensive, repetitive task is the sweet spot for uh, robots. This happened to uh, pool cleaning, low mowing, vacuum cleaning, and we are bringing it to uh, deck maintenance. So current solution, whether you do it yourself or you hire somebody to do it for you, uh, you need first to degrease it, then you scrub it, you power wash it, you let it dry for 48 hours, then you sand it, you hose it, you let it dry again, and finally, you can stain your deck. This will take you three to five days, and needs to be done once or twice a year. <clears throat> this tedious task doesn't come cheap, and will cost you up to $4,000 for a large deck. Let's speak about our solution. So like most robotic uh, solutions, we approach the problem a little bit different. And uh, using autonomous, uh, uh, autonomous technology, we are developing a robot that will clean and stain your deck every four weeks. Um, <coughs> this is a repetitive uh, task, which uh, we do very frequently, allows us an uh, inexpensive, low energy device. Uh, using a chemical process and inkjet technology, we are uh, cleaning and staining the deck showing the, the wood's natural beauty. Um, a docking station provides electric charging and refueling of the chemicals. And the result is a constant good deck condition over time. <clears throat> because today's solution is so labor intensive, we managed to reduce the cost by nearly 80%, which is dramatic. A little bit about technology for what I'm allowed to share. So we are using a patented, eco-friendly, water-based stain. Uh, the stain is transparent and preserves the wood pigment. This allows us to, work, to use a single kind of stain, no matter what's the original color of the wood. Uh, in order to apply a very accurate layer and uh, avoid uh, contact with the surface, we turn to inkjet technology, which is a mature, inexpensive technology. But because we don't need 600 or 1200 DPI, we can even downgrade the technology, making it cheaper and more reliable. At the end, this will be a fully autonomous operation. 
uh, using vision for accurate uh, systematic navigation. The robot will be connected device with an app and everything. Uh, finishing, just a business model. So our business model is actually the gift to keeps on giving, uh, like Gillette's razor, razor blade model, where we sell one time the device, and then we have ongoing revenue from uh, stain and disposable. Uh, that's it. If you have any questions uh, or want to take part in our project, please come and talk to me afterwards. And I'm always happy to meet with startups and entrepreneurs, uh, to meet one-on-one -on -one and try to help from my uh, 10 years of experience. Thank you very much.